My name is Ilan Mahmoud. I was born here in Melbourne and my family has been here since the late 1980s. I'm a graduate lawyer here at Slater and Gordon in the commercial and project litigation department. And I started off on the Manus Island class action, which was on behalf of 2000 detainees detained on Manus Island in Papua New Guinea. Now I primarily work in bushfire litigation and also shareholder class actions. One of the most important things for me about working in the law is that you are helping people that are vulnerable, that come to you with um, sometimes complex problems that they do not yet themselves understand and it is really your responsibility and you have the privilege of helping them through what sometimes is some of the most defining moments in their life. So working with these vulnerable people, you actually have the capacity to make an impact in somebody's life. It's really an honour and a privilege to be in a position where you are actually able to make a difference in someone's life. Um, working here is not just a nine to five for me. It's actually making sure that the work that I do is with a view of making someone's um, engagement with the legal system here in Victoria as positive as it can be. At the end of the day, I think the most important thing for me is just to be a member of a community that actually gives back, that recognises when they're in a privileged position and uses that to lift other people up with them. Um, and in saying that, I think that's why I'm most proud to be an occasional volunteer for the Eye for the Horn of Africa, which actually um, provides um, free screening and prevention treatments for people that are um, visually impaired back in Somalia. So looking the way I do and coming from the background that I do, um, I think you do have to recognise that it does come with its um, challenges. Um, but I do call it that. I call it a challenge because it is something that you can overcome with the right amount of support and the right amount of guidance. And here at um, Seder and Gordon, I find that I have uh, amazing support, um, both within my team and just the firm's values itself, that I've never felt like um, my background is a burden or it's in any way hindering my um, trajectory in the firm, but rather it's something that is valued as um, it basically is part and parcel of who I am. So I would say that there's no point in turning a blind eye to some of the attitudes and some of the challenges that you would face if you were to embark on any kind of journey here in Victoria. Um, but the trick is to facing those head on, um, knowing what you're up against and basically rallying all the tools, support, mentors that you can gather along the way to make your dream achievable. Um, Victoria's just generally a very energetic city to live in. There's always something going on, something that you can be part of.